know that, Billy. Drop your weapons! Put your hands on your heads! Got your hands up, Billy. What took you guys so long? <laughs> oh, shit. We're in trouble now. God damn it. Axel's AWOL. Maybe we can get out of this if we keep our mouths shut, Billy. So don't say anything. What the hell have you done here? Looks like a goddamn war zone. What the hell have you done here, Tagger? Tell me. We solved the alphabet crimes. You shut up! Who the hell is talking to you? I personally solved the alphabet case up in a body bag over an hour ago. And you? I don't give a goddamn what federal agency you say you're working for. You're in jail, buddy. Chief, wait a... Shut up! What the hell do you think you're doing here, bringing down a firefight in the middle of my city? You're out of the cop business for good, forever. Will you just listen a minute? Shut up! You shut your mouth once and for all. No, goddammit, you shut up! This is what the alphabet crimes are all about. Guns! Guns? That guy sold them and then bought them with stolen money from Adriano's and his own racetrack. He was on his way to Central America. And if you'd bother to take your head out of your ass, you'd see we'd stop the whole goddamn thing! You watch yourself! Just a minute, Lux. Why didn't I know about this? Because Chief Lutz doesn't have the guts to hear the truth from real cops. That's why we had to go undercover with Detective Foley to solve this case. That cuts it, Taggart. You're fired. Yeah? Kiss my ass. Kiss mine! You fired, too! Lutz. Isn't that right? I think I've just about had it with your abusive attitude. I'm sorry. I get carried away. I'm sorry. It's you are fired. Do you understand that? Don't overreact, Ted, please. You're fired. I want you out of here now. Get out of here! Fired! You'll regret this, Ted. I regret it now. I've regretted it for the last two months. You'll you regret this. You. You're out of here. Get out of here. Will you get out? Get out. Are they civilians now? You bet. I'm gonna kick your ass later. Axel, thank you so much, really. I've got to go to a charity meeting, Food for the Homeless for Beverly Hills. Oh, but tomorrow, Food for the Homeless. Wait a second, I'd like to make a donation, sir. It's $200 in the name of Sidney Bernstein. That's my alias. I don't like oh. a lot of publicity. Thank you, Axel. I mean, Sidney Bernstein. Thank you, gentlemen, very much. Thank you, sir. Thank you. If you get your head out of your ass long enough, kiss my ass, <laughs> you're getting more and more like me every day. Next thing you know, you're going to have afros, <laughs> big dicks and all that. <laughs> Axel, you make chief police yet or what? That's right. So you are the new chief of police? Inspector Todd, yeah. Ted Egan, your mayor of Beverly Hills. Listen, as I said to your mayor, I want you to know how thankful we are that you allowed Foley the time to help us with this case. Well, according to him, he's acquired all his skills under your expert tutelage. Certainly, he's just arrived. Hi! Expert tutelage? What the fuck have you been telling them? Let me talk. When you're done, let me talk to him. Yeah, now that you're done being a California hero, you better get your ass on back here to your real job. Yeah, OK, I'm leaving now. In fact, my ass left already. I got to catch up with it. Oh, yes, one other thing. Your secret undercover partner, Mario Andretti Friedman, wrecked the goddamn Ferrari. Hey, here, here, you talk to Jeffrey. Axel, Axel, you know what? It wasn't even my fault. That's the funny thing. There was a bus coming the other Hello? He hung up. He hung up. Hello? Come on, Axel, you don't have to go home now. Let's go down to Mexico and catch another marlin. Uh, I ain't going fishing. It's too tiring. We'll go back to Detroit for some good old-fashioned American street violence. Why don't you come with me? Your wife left you. Why don't you come hang out for a little while? I know a lot of girls that like to hang out with you. Maureen came back. Did she really? Congratulations. See the people you least expected? They're studs. The man is a stud. We ain't even know it. All this time, swinging. We ain't even know it. She couldn't live without you, right? And now her mother didn't have cable TV. <laughs> Don't think it was your mother's cable TV. It was your cable that brought it back. I'm off. Thanks a lot, Axel. You don't got to thank me. I love you guys. See you around. Be cool, man. Is there anything we can do for you? Yeah. Why don't you take care of my um, uncle's house till he gets back? Hey, Axel. That's not really your uncle's house, is it? Oh, yeah. Trust me. All right, what the hell is going on here? Who are you yeah. guys? Who's that black guy? Come on, baby. 